There's that man again. Well, I got something new to talk about, people. Let's get into it. What's going on, everybody, and welcome back to the Teddy Files. I am your resident sommelier, Mr. Dearest Teddy. And today, we have brand new fragrance on deck. Just came today. Uh, had a little bit of a snafu when it came to the delivery, but at the end of the day, they made sure they got it to me, and I'm very appreciative. Uh, shout out to One Track. They uh, got my fragrance to me, redirected it, rerouted it. They did the job. So I appreciate you guys. But here's the fragrance we are talking about. Let's see if we can get him to focus. Dad, thank you so much, Mr. Camera. That would be Luminous Ghost by Patek Mason. Well, Patek Mason, we ain't gonna try to get you fancy with this. But gorgeous box. Um, fragrance sits right here. So, you know, nice, uh, nice bit of weight. To the box uh you got your um batch codes and information and everything like that on the box so some people care about that so that's why i'm even talking about it i personally don't but hey i'm uh i'll talk to everybody i'll talk to anybody that uh is into fragrances and if you need to know what the batch codes and things are let's show you i'll show you guys one more time here you go there it is so authentic product but this is what the bottle looks like so it's 100 ml and you can see they really going with this whole ghost uh thing with this fragrance um very nice very heavy bottle nice sturdy top it doesn't snap into place i mean it holds in place pretty tight but it's a hefty top so quality uh quality put together but let's talk about this fragrance. So we're gonna get this on a strip first, and then I'll spray it on the skin. So, got your strip. It's one of your Teddy strips here. And let's see how far back this mist goes. That's nice. Good mist. Great scent. Get some of the alcohol off of it. That is a, oh man. Y'all already see it, right? They just put me on pause. Damn it. Yeah, this was worth the aggravation. This was definitely worth the aggravation of the delivery and all. That. This is awesome. This is awesome. I mean, it has, um, it has a, a, a creaminess to it. Uh, I would say that, um, as a matter of fact, the producer is in the room. Miss Producer, let me reach this over here to you. She's going to give us the verdict. Mm. Yum. Y'all heard it first. Producer. Yummy. Fergus is yummy. I'm not going to say that. She said it. <laughs> I mean, as fellas, if you're wearing it, somebody might tell you that you're yummy. Don't quote me on that. They may not. Don't don't look for somebody to tell you that you're yummy. And be careful who tells you that you're yummy. Watch that. But um, let's see. Let's get it on skin. So we got it on the strip. Excellent on the strip. Um, very floral, um, powdery. Has a little bit of sweetness to it, but not a playful sweetness. It's a sophisticated sweetness. Um, hence the sophisticated grizzly. So this is right up my alley. But let's get this right here on skin. Okay. So like wave it off some. Get some of the alcohol. It's not a lot of alcohol to it. It actually dries up pretty fast. Wow, that's a you get that bergamot. That bergamot shines off the skin. It's it's 
it's uh, bright. It's very bright and creamy. At the same time, you can smell the floral of the gardenia. Man, this is amazing, man. This is amazing. I'm, I'm getting ready to give you guys the fragrance notes. We got top notes of bergamot, coriander, and gardenia. The middle notes of apple and vanilla. And the base notes of woodsy notes, ambergris, tonka bean, and white musk. All of that makes sense because I smell every bit of that. Because that musk, that musky tone is coming in and you can smell that, the powdery nature and creamy nature of that tonka bean. This is awesome. This is awesome. Like, and right now, in this type of weather, spring weather, fall weather, winter weather, this will be amazing. Now, not so much summer, but everybody knows what I always say. You can wear your fragrances whenever you want. But as far as my recommendation, I would say it's a three season fragrance. And that would be spring, winter, fall. For me, I'm not gonna wear it in the summer. But if you get a cool night, maybe somewhere in the 70s, like uh, the lower 70s, somewhere it's lower to mid 70s, this actually would work too, this wouldn't work too bad. Uh, just be mindful of your sprays, don't overspray. People don't overspray spray none of your fragrances. Let me just say that to you right now. Don't 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 do that to yourself. Don't burn your nose out like that, and don't burn other people's nose out like that. But anyway, this fragrance here to me uh, is worth every penny that I spent. Uh, it's about one seventy or so, and um, yeah, and that bergamot's holding on. Like I'm all of the notes, all you can smell, all of the notes. The whole breakdown has come, and um, this is awesome. Damn it, this is awesome. This is really good, man. And it doesn't smell like anything that I've smelled before. Now, somebody else may have smelled something like this. I haven't. And so for me, this is new to my nose. This is the thing that's exciting to me about fragrances when you get your hands on something brand new to you. And this right here, to me, it, this is brand new to me. Um, and you guys might want to get your nose on this one. So I will leave a link in the description box to the company and they have samples so you can get yourself a sample of this so you won't have to buy the full bottle like me because i'm crazy um but i'm crazy like a fox because this smells damn good and you will not be upset if you get your hands on by Petit Maison luminous ghost well that's my time everybody thank you for coming over here and checking out this video and make sure you like share and subscribe to the content because it helps the channel to grow and tell me what you think um do you think I'm full of it about Petit Maison? Because trust me, I did not, uh, they didn't send this to me. Nobody sent anything to me. I ordered it, I paid my money, and I'm the one that sat at the door uh, like a, a puppy waiting for waiting for um, somebody to come home and feed him to get my damn um, package. But ultimately it was, it was the producer that got a hold of the package and I'm very appreciative to her for that. But everyone, Thank you for coming to join me. And um, remember, my name is Mr. Dieres Teddy, your fragrance sommelier. And over here, we don't do stinks, so please don't be a stinky. Have a good night.